I haven't really shot in this area in my living room actually for a very long time but now that I have a tripod I have a lot of options having said that this video is sponsored by Intel and Asus or Intel X Asus so thank you guys for sponsoring today's video actually this is the third video that they have, that they have sponsored and the last video so let's roll the intro So I made two videos so far talking about the Rogue Zephyrus Duo 15. Number one is the unboxing video. Number two is me actually designing in this video using Adobe XD and how me as a designer, how effective it was using this laptop. So for both of them, check that out in the description below or if you're watching this on your smartphone, tablet, desktop, I'll probably have the card somewhere here or there. So go ahead and check those out and come back for this video. So what did I really love about this laptop and what I did not like about this laptop? So go ahead. So let's go ahead and talk about that. I actually didn't have lunch right now, so I'm kind of like losing my memory. So first off, the laptop which Intel Aces gave me, it cost around $4,000. And yeah, that's a little bit expensive. However, if you go to the link in the, in the description below, you can see they have a lot of other options. Uh, a laptop that will quite suit your needs and this one that I have is an i9 and that is why it's very expensive i9 is the latest Intel processor but in their website they have i7 and they range anywhere between $2,500 to $3,000 so go ahead and check that out I have been using this laptop for about a month and a half and this has been my go-to laptop in terms of work so Monday to Friday 9 to 5 this is what I have been doing all of my work on, my, my uh, UX UI design in, Adobe, uh, using Adobe XD. Uh, when I'm editing a video like this, for example, I've been using Adobe Premiere. Really love the fact how you can take a lot of advantage with the dual screen. I don't really see myself using a laptop that doesn't have a dual screen anymore. It's, you know, it's, I kind of find that to be useless nowadays. And I feel like this whole dual screen, uh, screen is more futuristic. The multitasking feature is quite amazing. Check this out. So I have my Adobe XD right over here. So I'm designing whatever and then if I need to download icons or search for an uh, icon from a design, I can go to the browser and put it right here. So I can not only put my browser, I can put say youtube.com, listen to music, Spotify, etc. But check this out though. Like I have all these icons that I can surf while I have my design file open. This is one of the best features of this laptop. So this, this laptop is 4K, those of you who are wondering. I, I really love that fact because I, I have watched a lot of Netflix in here. All right, so I'm gonna play a 4K video. It's uh, Spider-Man from the PlayStation 4 or 5, whatever is out right now. PS4 is it or PS5 out right now? PS5. Yeah, so it's for PS5. And the speaker is in full volume. Pop-up street fair, best food in the city, awesome music. Man, this would be great for the last beat I was working on. The quality is actually very nice. I don't, I didn't really expect this from a laptop to be honest, but it blew away my mind. And therefore I started watching uh, Netflix and Disney Plus a lot in here. The speaker quality is amazing. I don't put it in 100% when I'm watching a TV show. I put it around like, 37% and that seems to be a great fit for volume wise. The only thing I don't like is to be honest is the fact that this laptop is a little bit bulky and I'm not a fan of this bulky laptop. So look at this and this point of view and then if you look at it like that, right? I think it's a little bit bulky. It is kind of heavy, uh, two kg, two kg plus, but the future and the specs that it holds definitely defeats a lot of its competitors. So it's extremely powerful. Yes, all of the USB that you see that goes around here are on its latest model. So you will not have a problem with that. HDMIs are obviously at the back and the Bluetooth connection is very solid. Also with the mouse pad, I'm not a big fan of the, the mouse pad. Then again, with all of my laptops in the past and recent, I never really liked the mouse pad at all. I would use my own mouse, connect it here, and surf the net, design, you know, things like that. This laptop is really smooth. Check this out. It's actually very smooth. 
and at nighttime when I'm typing it lights up so I have no problem whatsoever my office is really dark it's actually painted uh, dark navy blue is that it dark navy blue Hail navy blue, yeah, sorry about that. It's really great that this keyboard lights up during nighttime, so I really love that feature because my current laptop doesn't, not my laptop, but my current keyboard does not do that. So that's why I'm telling you, a lot of great features, man, in this laptop. So that was me as a designer's point of view, how effective this laptop is for me. And now I'm going to take you and show you how a marketer, a digital marketer, uh, someone who's not a, not a designer who has been using my laptop for over a week and let's see what is her response because her, her go-to laptop is an Apple laptop. So I'm very inter interested to see what is her point of view. So let's go ahead and do that. Hey, what's up? Just trying out the new laptop that you gave me. Yeah, so I gave you this for a week and a half? Yeah. Okay, cool. So what do you think? So let me let me talk to your viewers first. Hey guys, my name is Sam. I'm a digital marketing manager. I work in Toronto and Fahim gave me this laptop to try out for about a week and a half. And guys, trust me, I have been using Mac for four years. And as soon as I turned this laptop on, the first thing that I noticed was the aesthetics. Look at the keyboard. Oh my God, the colors. Being, I think just being a girl, aesthetics and beauty that matters to me a lot. So this, that was my first impression that it's amazing. So the second feature that I really like about this laptop is the dual screen feature. Uh, being into marketing, I have to use several softwares at the same time on day to day basis. So for example, say I'm running Google Ads. So the Google Ads dashboard can be on the main screen, whereas my key keyword dashboard can be on the second screen. Um, it's extremely good when you are trying to be productive and multitask at the same time. Say you run like a Zoom call. So Zoom call can be on the main screen, whereas you're doing your work on the second screen. Extremely helpful. Also, I noticed that when I had several different softwares running on the screen at the same time, the load speed was super fast and nothing freezed. I guess it's because of the Intel Core i9 processor that it's super fast. This laptop comes with a handrest, extremely comfortable for from ergonomics point of view. I think this is the only laptop uh, which gives so much comfort to the user. I understand when we are working like 8 to 10 hours a day. It, it's really nice though. Yeah, it's, it's really nice. And just, just look at this. And it's not even cheap. Yeah. I like, it was so comfortable like typing like this. When you're working like eight to 10 hours, it's like the wrist really hurts and you're typing eight hours. So this, this is like really good. Also a couple of cool features that I found about this laptop is they have something called as armory crate. So if you go inside that, you can actually see the CPU performance, noise reduction. You can put it into energy saving mode. Sorry, I had to skip this. Uh, GPU performance, this is for people who are like geek, nerdy, so they can know all these different features in here. Something also really cool was the handwriting feature. So if you are someone who takes like notes all the time or you have to sign a document all the time, I really like this cool feature. Say... Wow, that's cool. I would just play with it like that. Oh, and then it gives you like suggestions right here. Yeah, yeah. That's awesome. Click on one of them. I don't know what to do. I don't know, but I would just use it for signing documents and uh, stuff. Really cool feature. I would like to know as compared to iPad how smoother it is. Um, also, I would like if it came with a pen so I can compare both iPad and this laptop together for taking notes. So what are a couple of things that you didn't like about this laptop? Um, one is that the laptop is like really heavy. For me though, it's about 2.4 kgs. So I thought that's really heavy. Second thing is that I'm used to having the mouse pad in the center. Like automatically my hand goes in the center if I have to use it. So it being on the right side is a little tricky for me. Um, being into digital marketing and because of COVID, we are working from home a lot. I would have loved if the laptop had a camera, but I think it's more designed towards or more 
featured towards gamers and uh, designers who don't need a camera but for me i would have loved if there's a camera over here that makes sense yeah okay sam thank you so much can i please have my laptop back yeah sure go ahead it, okay. it was a really nice laptop like look at this guys. i know but, but I'm, I'm i'm going to keep it though okay cool okay bye bye, -bye. All right, so thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, if you're interested to purchasing this laptop, well, this one here, like I said, cost $4,000. But if you check out the link in the description below, you will see there are laptops with different sets of prices. And you can also select one that is more affordable to you. I have used this laptop as a designer and I love it. If I didn't get this laptop, I would definitely go to the store and purchase the exact same one. I, uh, and also you have seen that someone who's a marketer has used this laptop and she really liked it. The fun fact about this is I actually wanted a laptop like this. And I guess because of the universe, um, Asus came knocking on my door and you know, gave me this laptop. So thank you so much, uh, Asus and uh, Intel, yes, for you know, giving me this laptop. It is actually my go-to laptop. I am a PC guy, that's why I had no problem using this. And uh, yeah, if you, if you have any questions regarding this laptop or you have bought it, comment below and let me know. Until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. A lot of my design videos are gonna be in here. All right, peace out.